Hi, I uh, learned a new trick today and I thought I would share. What I would need to do is to take the, uh, the bearings out of my uh, upper control arm uh, for my Mini. And I've seen it done where people weld a bolt in there and pull it out. And I've seen special $50 bearing puller tools that work quite well. But I just did it with a 15 cent washer and I'm going to show you what I did. Now, first of all, I took a washer. I flattened the sides. Now, the flat sides are about three quarters of an inch. Um, the washer started off at about, I think it's a seven eighths. It's 0.875 anyway, 22 millimeters. And I think 19 millimeters is what it is across the, across the flats. This will now drop in to my arm and um, just take a screwdriver and turn it around so that it's sitting flat. I just have to make sure that I've got it positioned right. Not quite, it's got to come up a little bit. Where did my other screwdriver go? Um, so I got it into place. It took a little fiddling this time, but it is now sitting flat on the other bearing. And uh, so I will There we have it. The bearing is out. Um, I am going to do the bearing at the other end, but obviously a washer without the flat on it would work this point but but the same principle if I can get this to, uh, to drop in there straight It's not really sitting flat. I'm going to hammer at it. It should go flat. Okay, yeah, that did it. Now it's. And there's the bearing. There's my washer. One more to go. This was actually the uh, first one I did, but I just did the one end because I wanted to demonstrate how the washer would drop in there. Easier said than done getting it in the second side. Okay.
that's it. Bearing number four went to the floor. They're all out. Oh, that helps.